Right, so I've just finished this. It took me about 20, just over 20 minutes, but I'll stop starting explaining stuff. It's a 20 minute workout that you can do anytime you like. It's very effective for arms and abs, and you should feel pumped up. Kit you need is a little bit of weight. I've got an eight kilo kettlebell, and I've got two, three kilo dumbbells. Just some dumbbells will do a suffice, and you'll find your weights yourself. It's all built on your own size and strength. So, hope you have a go, enjoy these ones. So, if you haven't got any time for training, you make some gear up a little bit earlier. I'm going to do sort of 50s of everything rather than 100s first thing in the morning so arms and abs focusing on exercises just for the arms and the abs and arms and backs i've been tabbing been running another full body kit so just working on arms which include shoulders back pecs and so on biceps triceps and your abs which is obviously all your stroke muscles and the sides included all i've got is two three kilos dumbbells over there some weights and warming up with some press ups where it's just leaving my knees fully flat to the floor that way. Then we'll go elbows in, triceps. We're going to do 50 of these one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, twenty. And I'm doing supporty ones with my knees. If you haven't read one, this is part of the warm up. So, light exercises. Still tough though. 21, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 30. And I'm aiming to get 10 exercises done. Five on my arms, five on my abs. So, it'll be 500 reps done. All within about 20 minutes. 30, 1, 2, 3. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, forty. Feeling that already? Whew. Let's get them finished. Then go on to another abs one. So blood shunting is going to go into my abs and my arms. Abs and arms. Leave my legs out of it in a full body like bare peas and running. Ten to do. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four. Three, two, one. Straight to a stomach exercise. I'm going to go with not the usual half sits. I've got a kettlebell here. I think it's eight kilos. Mini squat position. Tension on. Twist but stop. So I'm not just literally twisting. I throw myself around. I have to put the brakes on. So this sub puts the brakes on, pulls me back, and then vice versa. There and back to one. Got a good grip, can hold the kettlebell like this if I wish. One, two, three, four, five. So it's not just literally swinging, wait for it to stop and come back. I'm putting the brakes on, which creates a stomach tension. It's important to get that, otherwise, you're just literally swinging your arms about like this. I'm going around, trying to sound this. One, two, three, four, back straight. Five, six, seven. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty. And the tempo I'm doing that is so it is pretty quick. So it's got some speed as it comes round and requires a lot of pull to pull you back. So it's basically it's like getting both your muscles and tense, 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 tense each side is pulling you left and right. If you go too fast, then it'll do mini little ones. And if you go, if you don't just swing, well you might as well just do that with your arms. It's your stomach that's getting used on the sides. So we're on 31, 32, 33, 30. 35, 36, 7, 38, 39, 40, 1, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50. One set of each done. Back into you just looking for the arms. I'll do this on my knees. Three kilos. You can have two kilos, you can have tins of beans. 
a bottle, half a litre bottle is half a kilo. But it's got to be just punch up and then back to the chest. So it's and a good fast pace, blast 50 out easy. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 31, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 41, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 50. 50 done. Nice and fast, it's to get blood pumps into the area. First thing in the morning, it's just gonna have six. My next one. We're doing half six but with so I've got a minimal bit of kit so it's just about an eight kilo kettlebell feet under the couch kettlebell held one my back shoulders are going to the floor I'm just going back to the tension point as I'm falling I should turn the camera on here in fact I will so I'm just going to there one two so not all the way back to the rest point and we're going backwards it's using mostly these called the hip flexors where the stomach muscles connect into the legs so it's a lot of the top of the leg muscle with a very low lower part of your stomach muscles so that's going to pull me back and forth one two a stomach and leg three four five six seven eight ten you can hear the string in your voice so your stomach should be exhale, blow out all the way. So my stomach's blowing out, makes my stomach shrink anyway. If you hold your breath in, you've got a bump to go over. So each one should be a hard breath out. So 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 23, 24, 25. Also, it's working my very lower back so when you think of doing stomach muscles obviously one muscle has to pull and another one has to release and then in reverse when you're moving back and forth so we have like our biceps when they pull up your triceps release same thing when you pull your stomach in your back releases but on reverse when you're going back it will tend to hold the stomach for that point so we are doing back and front 25 done six seven eight twenty nine thirty 31, 2, 33, 34, 5, 6, 8, 9, 40. Not trying to do 50 all at once because I'll end up doing bodge ones. Everyone has to count, you've got to be honest with yourself. Don't score 50 if you did 30 good ones and 20 bodged it. 10 to do, just rock. 1, 3, Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, fifty. Whew. I'm stopping because I need to change the camera out. So, back in two. Just now three kilos again. And what I was doing before was punching, so using most of those shoulders. Press up some triceps, was on there. Now we're going to get this rapid. I'm going sort of as if I'm doing that way and that way. But nice and fast, should smash these out, three kilos, so I'm a guy, I suggest one to two, if you're slightly built, a lot more if you want to go stronger, but the aim is to do them fast, let's get the blood pumps up, so we're doing a quick early morning workout, so one, two, three, four, five, six, show you how is it, eight, so the slow motion, going to there, just from leveling my shoulder, and going back down again, nine, ten, eleven, 12, 13, 14, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 1, 32, 3, 34, mechanically, I'm going up, I'm putting it down, 35, 36, 7, 30, 8, 39, 40, 
50. So back into using our abs. I'm going to use a full strength muscle now. So now this might work better from this way. I'm just going to go all the way up, all the way up. So should be down, one, and two. I've got one foot slightly under the couch, which is good to anchor myself so my feet don't flap up. If you're doing it from your side. I'm just going right down and up again. So five, six, keep my arms up here because the axe is a weight to resist. If you want to help yourself, put your arms out in front, makes it easier. Or throw your arms, they'll throw you up. That makes it that's the easiest way of doing it. Arms back, throw, the dead easy way to do it. Toughest, arms like in the fight mode. What was the arm? So seven, eight. Nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seven. The reason I'm going flat is so that now I'm flat here. The upper part of the stuff, which was these very top intercostals ones, they have to pull and they pull literally all the way down. It's like that's the first pulling point against your rib cage, and then they come right down through your stomach. So it's, if you know what's going on, I think it helps you rather than just making it into a chore of actually just get them done, get them done. You understand why, you'll buy into it. I think it was an 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 6. Breathing out with your cups, 27, 8. Nine, thirty. Rest when you feel you need to bodge one. Thirty done. Thirty one. Thirty two. Foot straps under the couch definitely helps. Thirty four. Thirty five. Thirty six. Thirty seven. Thirty eight. Nine. Four. See. Body one, body two, body three, body four, body five, body six, see seven, eight, forty nine, fifty. Abs done. Back into the arms. So these are called TikToks. It's like doing a TikTok action of a you see the old fashioned clockwork soldiered um, dot models. So it's on one shoulder and it travels down the other one, tick and tock. Not that stupid app that gives people a 10 second attention span. And the main thing of this is it's right down the shape of the body. All the way up, all the way down. Don't start dropping it forward. If you get tired, that's why it makes it easy. So coming up, and it's not let it drop, it's a dead leggy for one. It's lift and lower, lift and lower. So you're getting two actions. The shoulder's pulling it up, and the shoulder's using it to go down again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, teen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. And I've said this many a time, especially in classes. The reason I'm counting out loud is not just for if anyone's watching this and joining in. Both there are, but count out loud. It's a really good psychological tool it's the first thing you're thinking of it keeps you in track of the numbers you're doing and you're busy thinking of something to do because if you don't you're just trying to get through it lazy brain will go hit hey, it hey, hit this aches that aches oh, let's stop let's take more rest let's go to the toilet let's go get a drink i'll find an excuse to quit so back in 21 22 23 24 25 20 6 20, 7, 20, 
8, 20, 9, 30, 30. One, now they're adding up, I can feel them. I want you to start doing that way and trying to jack them up with your body and it's got to be lift, lower, mechanical man, tick, tock, tick, tock. If you start doing this, you're assisting with throwing your body weight or letting them flop and then trying to get some sort of heave to throw them up. You're cheating yourself, lift and lower. 30 done, I'm gonna bodge it. Well, I won't wanna bodge it because I won't do it. But if I feel my form's going, I'm recovering, so 10 seconds off. 30, 1, 30, 2, 30, 3, 30, 4, 30, 5, 30, 6, 30, 7, 30, 8, 30, 9, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50. And that will get your shoulders literally full pumped full of blood. So what the aim is today is to get the blood pumped up so you get that instant body pump feel. The shoulders are really full of feeling it now. Like, it just inflates you. Right, so last one. Last one for abs. Nice simple one. Feet six inches. Leaning far back as I can, arms to balance if I can, and then just pulse two, three, four, five, six, eight, nine, ten, one, two, three, four, and five, six, seven, eight, nine, twenty, one, two, three, four, five, six, eight, nine, thirty, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine forty. Hold for a bit. This is the last one. It's the last ten reps, and then we'll wrap it up. Go get shower. Go to work. Forty. One, two, three. Slow as I dare. Four, five, six, eight, nine, ten. <sighs> Done. In roughly twenty minutes. Five hundred reps. 50 of each, you don't have to be 20 minutes, it can be, you can set yourself 20 minutes to get through the 10 exercises, or you can say, I'm gonna work until I've done the 10 exercises, and you can do 10 at a time, in batches of 10, batches of 20, whatever, it's yours. It's a simple list, you get, here's my list, here's what I'm gonna do, make your statement, go out and do it. 20 minutes, 25 minutes, should be done by mostly everybody, and then get yourself showing off to work. No excuse to miss it, and that's abs and abs.